hello and welcome back to my channel julia here from english prep class in today's video i'll just be talking about can i add extra word in the right from dictation absolutely you can this hasn't changed even i was on the official piercing website some minutes ago and i still tried it especially on those um, sample questions you put there and i got the same score okay i got the answers so you can still go ahead and put the extra score in the pte um, right from dictation it will still help you do not joke with this task because this task has a way of boosting your writing score. This task single-handedly can boost your writing score with up to 40 marks. So you can't be playing with this task. When it comes to the PTE listening, you would have to manage your, your time very well. And now the first task in the PTE listening, which is a summarized spoken test, the computer manages your time for you. But after that, the remaining seven tasks, you can manage your time yourself. Now that means that for those tasks that are not relevant, you should just take them, um, while the audio is going on, you can just figure out the answer and click on the answer. Then that way you're saving time. Make sure you get to write from dictation. Why am I spending time talking about this task? This task is the last task in the PTE exam. And funny enough, it gives so much score to the PTE writing. It is that relevant. It actually gives marks to the PTE writing more than it gives marks to the PTE listening where it belongs. That's hilarious, right? I don't know why they did that. And then that, not just that, they put that task at the last point of the exam. That means if you do not manage your time, if you don't have good time management skills, there's a strong tendency that you will not get to that task. Or if you get there, you might not finish it. There are usually three or four of this task on your test day. Recall that the PTE writing doesn't have a lot of scores. It just got two tasks, summarize written test and the right essay. So these two tasks can't even give you 50. They can also give you 65, not to talk of 79. So if you want to get a high score in your PTE writing, this right from dictation is one task that will guarantee you that high score. Are you looking for 79? Are you looking for 65? Then take this task seriously. There are usually three or four questions on test day so make sure you practice a lot of them before your exam day you know if when you hear the question if you need to write it on your jotter or you need to type type straight into the provided blank first find out the one that works for you and also manage your time if you manage your time you can get to that particular question because it's the last task in the entire exam when you finish you see end in the exam you click on end or finish in the exam but if you don't finish the exam the computer automatically locks you out because there's a time duration you have to finish this task okay so take this task seriously i'm going to go ahead to the official piercing website and i'm going to show you some of this question and exactly how i did it and you can see the extra words I'm adding. I'm going to explain what I mean by extra word and you will see the extra word I'm adding and you will still see that I got everything. Nothing has changed when it comes to write from dictation. So you know what? Do not be scared. Go on, still write the things that you write or go on and see add extra word. That way you're certain that you will get the exam. Let's head on straight to the official piercing website and see what they've got. All right, hello guys. So we are actually on the piercing PTE official page and uh, i already logged on okay and uh, so i'm just going to click on um assessing your pte academic score practice test remember we're going to be using their free sample questions that's what we're going to be using assess your test pre-test checks so i'm just going to scroll down and you'll see sample questions see results see sample questions and see preparation materials so i'm going to assess the sample questions because what we want to show today will be coming from the sample questions you're going to see how i'm just going to go ahead here you're going to watch me write out the answer listen to the questions and write from dictation and write out the answer just stay with me don't click out on the video yet all right start so i'm going to listen and i will type exactly what i heard you will see the corrections I'll make and you will see their chances. Final year business students have to write a 5,000 word essay on market trends. So, um, when I talk about extra words, this is what I mean. So, I wrote the 5,000 in words. Or in figure rather so i'm just going to also put a comma and just put five thousand because i just don't know the one they would take okay so let's see um and i can't exit here there are three questions which we are going to do 
So we're going to see my response and we're going to see their transcripts. And you can see that everything has remained the same. You can see add extra word, it hasn't changed. So let's look at this final year business students. It's not in talk about one. So I'm going to put students have to write a 5,000 comma 5,000 in words market trend. Then I put a full stop because it's a sentence. Then I'll click on next to go to the next one. Let's see what it says. The time of the maths lecture has been changed to 10.30. So either I'm going to do this 10.30 because I'm not so sure. I'm going to put comma or I put 10.30. Yeah, these are the things that came into my head. The time of the maths, mathematics, I know it's maths. But you can also, if you're not so sure, you can put maths. Okay, if you're not sure, you can do that. So these are the extra words I mean. After writing what you think you heard, and if you're not so sure, you can write another one. And then for this, um, has been changed to, oh, sorry, there's a mistake here. Into I put it in figure 1030, and I have this in word, and there's a full stop. So I'm going to go to the last question, and let's, then we can check the answer at the end. Just hang in here with me. You must submit your assignments by next Friday at the latest. All right, so she said you must submit your assignments. Uh, so I'm not so sure if it's assignments or assignments. So I'm going to do that. So that's the extra word I'm adding. So this is the aim of this video to see if the extra word we add in the, in the PTE exam is still working. Okay, so let's see. I've put you must submit your assignments. Assignment. Uh, I'm going to put a comma here by next Friday at the latest. So I put a full stop. So I'm going to finish. And let us see. All questions have been attempted. Do you want to submit the activity now? So I'm going to click on yes. And um, yeah, we're going to continue. That means you're going to go check the results and see if they have given us the transcripts. Okay, now these are the ones I've done. I just wanted to do this one right before you so you see the answer. Now, this is it. So this was what I wrote. Final year business students have to write a 5,000 comma 5,000 word. Now this is what they have here. Final year business students have to write, look at what they wrote, 5,000 in figure, another 5,000 in figure, but with a comma after the five, 5,000 in words, five figure, 1,000 in words. So that's the first one. The second one says, this is what I wrote and this is what they have. The time of the maths. So look at it. They actually put theirs in bracket, but you can still put it this way and you still get your answer has been changed to 10.30. Look at their 10.30 here. Look at my 10.30. Look at another one. Look at another one. And then the last question says, you must submit your assignment, but I wasn't so sure. So I put assignment, assignment by next Friday at the latest. So they just wrote straight, you must submit your assignment. But this will also fly because, I mean, we have seen it happen in the previous ones we have done. So this will also fly. So that is it. This um, <clears throat> extra word is still working. It hasn't changed. So do not panic in the PTE writing. Just concentrate on doing this task very well and the reading and writing fill in the blank task in the reading. So my spoken test from the listening, fill in the blanks from the listening. That's where you can be sure of 65 and all that. So this is it, guy. That's it. You can see from the official piercing website that everything is easy. You can see that the extra words are still there. I'm still getting it because they also approve of it. So if you're new here on my channel, this is good. It's a good start for you. You can go ahead and add extra word in case you didn't know. Remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Remember to hit the like button and turn on the bell notification because I bring out new videos every week. I'll see you in my next video. Stay safe. Bye. Watch out.